you have you know some 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 projects yeah I've got uh, I did a documentary uh, I did the narrative for a documentary in Romania last year uh -huh. and I plan to go back and do a uh, at least two films there and and maybe another one over overseas so all these are in the Re works in um, Romania okay oh that's that's your okay it's your future project okay um all right, Keith. I'm I'm sorry. I'm you know um, like I'm not. Well, you, you you saw the the idea of the movie. You understand what's going on. You, you the article. I don't know if you looked at the article. I mean, you know, I, I have it on, on on show one. I can send you the link. Um, but you know, uh, that's pretty much the you know the, the six things. Like there there's a behind the dresser. The guy moves it, and then he has a Aquila century. You know, to basically his daughter and six other children. Just, just sick stuff. And, you know, okay. you look like a guy, you know, that can, you know, play, you know, a good guy and then, you know, transforms into, like, you know, this monster, like this Dahmer. So basically like a Harrison Ford type of guy, you know, always honest, always a brave, always true, um, always a good guy. But then, you know, in, in the basement, you're, you're a monster, you're, you're, you're a horrible, um, you know, you're a horrible guy. And that, that's, you know, I think that that's, that's really hard to, to act like, you know, um, to, to, to be that kind of actor, but, you know, I don't know, man, uh, like Harrison Ford just plays good guys, and then, you know, you have, um, I don't even know, or I think Nicolas Cage, he does good guy, bad guy movies. He's recently done some pretty bad guys, but Nicholas used to be, for the most part, a good guy in most of them, but he's kind of mixed it up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Recently. Yeah, but so, you know, Nicolas Cage, great, great actor, great oh, acting, awesome. and um, just awesome. he puts everything, and I hope you can put everything into this film. Um, I'll give it everything film. I have. Yeah, yeah, and, I, and I'm working with um, uh, the Tucson Short Film Society on this, you know, and it's not just me, it's the um, field production cameras of Excess Tucson, um, and, you know, we're, we're, um, we have two cameras, you know, lighting, um, uh, uh, voice and, and everything you know to make this successful, and um, you, and you have somebody also from New York helping you, don't you? Um, yeah, uh, Matt Mickelson. Well, I, I explained to him the idea, but um, uh, he's he's kind of he's there. We talked about doing like Blade Runner two, but Ridley Scott is is doing that. Like he wanted to help Ridley Scott, but yeah, it's. I mean, it's pretty much me, Ursula, and um, uh, two other um, film producers. Yeah, Matt Mickelson, he's a great friend, Matt McCleveland. But um, but yeah, man, uh, I, I'm gonna you know message you on Facebook about about you know obviously this show you know um, you know so if if you want to you know come on to the next show, sure. that's great. I'll make um, a, a Facebook page, a Twitter page, um, all kinds of social media to you know basically explain this movie and yeah and show you and you know give you the script and uh, and Ursula will be you know. Uh, in the same in the same area with that and um, so yeah hopefully you can make it you know to, to next to the next show okay and I'll, I'll give you an update and, and on social media also you'll get updates so I look forward to this film all right I think it's gonna be yeah 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 next order. all right Keith all right Ross you, Jake all right um, and then we have Dan yeah thank you thank you Keith all right Jake and then Dan and then we're gonna have a little song Okay, can you get prepared, Bobby? Oh, it's done? It's done. Okay, well, we're, we're just gonna embrace. We're gonna have a, a group hug, and that's it. All right, Jake. Um, okay, I'm Chevy sure. Van Band. Chevy okay. Van Band. Yeah, sorry, I, I tried to fit you in earlier, it's man. It's okay, I'll be. I'll be Chevy there. Van Band. Okay, we're gonna have. Um, uh, so, all right. Please, it's, it's a pleasure to be on your show. Thank you. Thank you. I hope you watched the first show. Met you at. Um, uh, where did I meet you at? Sky Bar, right? I think I met you at Sky Bar. Open I think it was Mike. on Fourth Avenue. Yeah. Yeah, I met you at Fourth Avenue at Sky Bar Open Mic. Yeah, Mike. yeah, yeah. And in I was going up there to play drums and. Yeah, Tucson Woodstock actually, and Tucson Woodstock still doing the project, working with Woodstock Ventures. Actually, uh, you were interested in that project, and you were like, "Hey, man, yeah, I want to do it." Um, and um, so yeah, uh, you know, Chevy Van Ben, I, I'd like you guys to play, you know, with Flem and um, who was, you know, I was on his show, the Art Fest show, and. Um, yeah, Flem's like a really, really awesome guy, and yeah, um, he's, he's been a lot of fun to work with in this project. Yeah, he he is like yeah. the nicest guy. You can ask him anything, and he's <coughs> like, you know, he's really cool. Yeah. Um, so you guys will play at, at, at Tucson Woodstock, right? Yes, we will. All right, we'll uh, be happy to play it with Tucson Woodstock. And, yeah, yeah. And we're trying to get all the shows we can. And my new project on Silver Wings, which if, if, if right, well, right gonna, here. 
We're gonna. It's on the. Um, on the screen right here. All right. All right. Let's see. Let's famous see drummer it. in my family just died. Rocco Estrella. He's played with Stevie Nicks and the Doobie Brothers. Um, I guess as a guest drummer. Is that is that was he on Silver Wings or was that, is this your project? No, this is my project on Silver Wings. Okay. This is my new project. Right. Right. Which if you um, click another one up, there's a there's a memorial going on right now. Okay. For um. All right, that's the second slide. Yeah, it's the second slide coming up. Yeah, yeah, we. Oh, you we, gotta do it with the. The mouse, the mouse. The mouse. Yep. Click the second one. Did he click it? There you go. The no, 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 that's right the, there. The. Okay. Well, anyway, that's the um, that's the new project that's on Silver Wings. That's JJ Styles, my guitarist. Uh huh. From High Intentions, a very adept guitarist, and of course me on drums. We play at Punk Rock Tuesdays. Yeah, and yeah. On Silver Wings, there'll be a lot of metal influence, Iron Maiden, um, Judas Priest, early Judas Priest, Iron, and um, Iron, Iron Black Maiden, Sabbath. Iron Maiden, Judas Priest. And we just found a, a new singer. He sounds like Marilyn Manson. He's excellent. Really? He's just what we were looking for. Oh, my God. Like, really, like, medieval sounding, you know? That's the sound we're going after right now, like a medieval metal yeah, sound. Yeah, no, I like that, man. I, I like Marilyn Manson. I like Judas, Judas, Judith Priest. I've been listening to them. Iron Maiden. I think I've heard, yeah, I've heard some of their songs. But, um, you know, um, yeah, J or Judas, Judas Priest. Yeah, Judas, Judas Priest. Judas Priest, yeah. And we like the early Priest, you know, like Diamonds and Rust, Sag uh, Wings of Destiny, um, Point of Entry. Yeah. Their early stuff's really good. That's what we're kind of like. Yeah. Our influences come from. Yeah, I, I mean, yeah, I like, I mean, obviously, like, I, I like Marilyn Manson, just, um, uh, that's just me, you know, uh, Judas Priest, just when I chill out, you know, I listen to him, uh, Iron Maiden, you know, when I chill out, but, but yeah, Marilyn Manson, I mean, um, uh, what was that, what was that song, um, uh, the Around the World, or I forgot, um, um, let's see. Around a way. These things are made of me, or what? Um, the oh, sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. Sweet yeah, dreams. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sweet dreams are made of yeah, these. Yeah, that is awesome. That yeah, is, um, yeah. That is a classic, and um, and of course the beautiful people. That's a great song too. I yeah, beautiful people. Of course, yeah. man. Yeah. And his Halloween song, his Halloween theme song. What it's is another that? really good song. What is that? This is Halloween. This is Halloween. Oh, from the yeah. Tim Burton. Um, yeah, yeah, I think it's. I yeah, dude. I'm, I don't know where he got it, but he got it. Somewhere. I love Tim Burton, dude. He, he did it good. Oh my god, Tim Burton is like um, he's a genius. Do you yeah. like? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, uh, Day Before Christmas, awesome. That's what it came from. That's right. That's right. Yep. I, I remember hearing that recently. So, All right. Yeah. So you think you guys will? S I mean, the singer would be, you know, like, will he sound kind of like this? Well, well, he's tall, Maryland he wears Mance. trench yeah. coats, and um, he, like sounds, he seems yeah. really excited about being in a project, and it's been a few days, so I, it looks like, since I contacted him, so his name is Chris, and it looks like he's going to work out so far. No, dude, I'm yeah. really, I'm. if you're talking about Marilyn yeah. Manson type, dude, I'm uh, really, Sweet Dreams, Beautiful People, this is yeah. only, if, you know, uh, if, The if, Worm, if he oh, that. I didn't hear that. Antichrist Superstar. Uh, yeah, it's uh, old, old Marilyn Manson I used to listen to, like, back in the late 90s. No, he, he is really, I mean, he's up there with, like, you know, with, with, with I don't even know, like, Bowie, I guess? I mean, that's, because he's, like, the weird kind of, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So. He's, he's, he's pretty cool. Um, so that's where our music can be modeled after those things right. that we mentioned. So present. Our influences. So in, in your past, um, uh, your dad, what was your dad's? Um, My dad's band was Mojo Navigators, right. which is, and then he had a Grateful Dead cover band, um, a tribute band uh -huh. called Circles End. It's spelled right. S-Y-K. Yeah. Uh, S-Y-K-L-E-S, -S. Circles, yeah, Circles End. All right, I'm going to have to get the spelling after your show. Yeah. But, um, yeah, and um, uh, you gave me that CD, man, of your dad. That was good. Yeah. That was good. Yeah. You, Thank you. You have an interesting Thank dad. You. Thank and you. Um, I, I, I love that CD. It was, um, it was, it was interesting. Um, yeah, so um, I guess we could... Do our group pub and close out. Well, well, I got Dan. I got Dan. Okay, okay. I got Dan. Well, wait, wait. Um, uh, wait a minute. Um, you're. Uh, uh, wait a minute. Uh, okay, circles on future projects. Future projects definitely um, on Silver Wings and yeah, the Chevy Van okay. Band is unaffected. Right. The Chevy Van Band is yeah. still the Chevy Van Band. Will always be up there at O'Malley's parking lot. 
practicing. All right. Um, every night, usually after midnight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have Joseph Wayne Miller as our guitarist. He's yeah, at a, at a, very at, talented. At O'Malley's, which is right, right in front of, right next to the rack. Yep. The rack, and then yep. you have I forgot what other yeah, restaurant, yeah. but but um, but yeah, dude. And I I actually played with you. I just I practiced with you guys. Just yeah, remember yeah, that? You remember yeah. that? I sure do. You yeah, were, man. You were you were playing keyboard with us, and keyboard, that was a great night. My, High five. My, my Korg. <laughs> High five. All right. And and you know I, I really enjoyed that and um, yeah I, I hope you know if you can come on my next show BLDS show three mm -hmm. yeah and yeah. explain you know on Silver Wings and um, uh, um, any other projects and the slides do you have any other slides or that's it um, there is one more with some live music and this is from our New Year's show is it's um bass and drums but it, it was um it was a good show. Flem has a way of dirtying up the amps to make it sound like guitar. All right. Yeah, like, we have uh, almost no time left. Okay. Yeah, but they but wouldn't let us bring the band I'm going to get Dan in here. Okay, maybe you guys can just, um... Dan, take... All right, a little intro, like, a couple second intro of us and, and Dan and... Yeah, dude, yes. Sixth person. All right. all right, all right, all right, all right. The mic. Um, yeah, we don't. Um, it's pretty much we can hear it. We have mics up here. So, uh, Dan, uh, the basement. Um, uh, he's, you're out of time. I yes, I am out of time. All right. Well, uh, the basement. Uh, the rooster. What, what is the name of that song? Uh, the rooster song, or what is it? Um, I got a little red rooster. All right, all right. I know some various chicken songs, but I think that's the one you mean. Little red rooster. Yes. I got a little red rooster. Too right. lazy to crow for. I, mean, I guess we're, we're we're rolling. Yeah, yeah. If you can do that bit, and I'm sure you you worked a lot in your past uh, on music. Did you, how many years about in the past have you? Oh, I was born into it basically. Yeah. So like from you know five six years old. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, can you um, can you play that? Um, I got a little red rooster. Basically, that's one of the um, you know the soft parts of the movie. Uh, basically, you know, husband and wife, you know, in, a, in in their relationship. That's how I see it. Too lazy to croak for 